Uh, it's a pleasure to be here today, and we have a very interesting topic. Democracy in Turkey? Uh, is it under threat? Is it booming? Is it democracy? Uh, all those questions are there. I wrote with a, a book with uh, uh, Kitab here uh, about uh, democracy in Islam, and uh, writing that together uh, with a a Muslim scholar was very, very important in coming to understand, A, what I meant by democracy, what he might mean by democracy, and what democracy might mean anywhere else. It's a very interesting issue, and we've got two speakers today. One had better arrive sooner, I'll bring his neck, but that's already moved down the hall and get him. Um, but we'll start with Associate Professor uh, Issan Yilmaz, who is the Associate Professor in Political Science at Fatih University in Istanbul. Uh, he's also director of their PhD program in political science and international relations uh, at the university's Institute of Social Science. Got his uh, BA from Bosporus University in 1994, PhD from London's uh, School of Oriental and African Studies, affectionately known as SOAS for most of us, uh, in the Faculty of Law and Social Sciences in 1999. Research interests are Islam, constitutional law, and human rights, Turkish politics, Muslim legal pluralism, Islamic movements, the Turkish diaspora, and Fethullah Gulen's faith-based movement. He's worked at the University of Oxford. He's had uh, leadership roles within SOAS, uh, and uh, he's published you know, widely in this area and is a columnist for today's Zaman, the English daily language published in Turkey. Uh, Professor Yomaz, please come and address us. Thank you, everyone. It's uh, excellent to be here uh, again in this country. I was here for the first time about five years ago for another conference. Uh, Australia is known uh, as a, with its exemplary uh, role uh, being a multicultural, tolerant society, a country of 